Good morning everyone. Today is six days before Christmas. Darsana, Joe and Mahima are coming here for lunch and probably they're gonna stay till dinner and they're gonna go back. Joe and Darsana came from all the way from Seattle for holidays. Today it's a little bit uh, cold and it's a kind of a little bit snowy in the morning but snow has stopped. As you can see in the background here, the snow, there's a little bit snow left there. Joe and Darsana they are staying at the Mahima's place because they want to stay a couple of days there before they come here. They are going to come here today for the day. Sakun is preparing food for them. Welcome to my video. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please do subscribe, share, and write a comment below. Here's all the food preparation here. It's uh, you know, cut onions uh, and the scrap from the onions. Foods are being prepared. This is slow cooked chana, chana chole, and potato is being cooked here. Still in Hanyata? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so what else you are picking up? Is, it, is this all you need? We're, we came here because of you guys. I think that's all mom said. Okay, no cabbage? Uh, no cabbage, we have cabbage. Okay. Oh, they came all hungry and so we have all these food ready here. This part is really pretty. No, I think you like spice. Yeah, it's really pretty. Yeah, it's really pretty. You got a nice color. Yeah. How about Joe? Joe can eat the spicy? Yeah. Okay. This is tofu, tofu chili. This is chickpeas. Chana choli. White rice. Popper. Very simple, vegetarian. That's it. Uh, yeah, that's fine. For dinner? I love How is it food, Good. Do you like it? Yeah. Did you try tofu? Mm -hmm. Is it good? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good? Yeah. Uh-oh. is enjoying with the eating with the fingers. The fingers do look beautiful with the snow. Yeah, they are playing some kind of game. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. I finally had one that made sense. I was like, yes, I got this. Looks like it's a funny game. You guys are laughing. <laughs> While they had a lunch and they were playing games, after playing the game, they may have gotten hungry. So for the snack, we are doing samosa and edimama. How are you doing with the edimama? <laughs> How is edimama though? It's good. Good? Yeah, it's a very healthy snack. <laughs> and Samsara, what do you think about edimama? Do you like edimama? I love edimama. Oh, that's good. The samosa is coming out of the fryer here. And this is a little bit healthier samosa. Oh. It's not deep fried. The samosa is being served to our jilajam. <laughs> jilajam means solid in law. <laughs> and here's the sauce, Maggie sauce. And there's an actual uh, samosa sauce. Do you want to try that? Okay, after samosa sauce. Yeah. Have you this tried one. samosa sauce? Yeah. This one. Oh, oh yeah, samosa. Yeah. Oh. yeah. I'll try samosa sauce. Cameron. Yeah. I like Maggie. 
Yeah. So I'm sorry, it's with Maggi or ketchup, right? I use Maggi. Yeah. Oh, eating dry? Oh, okay. Wait, I'm mm -hmm. waiting. Oh, oh I see. You're eating. Okay. Okay. This your fried samosa is amazing. For tonight, we are going to eat Maggi, Kalu Dal, Alu Achar, main dish. And that's what is going on. This is the preparation for Alu Achar here. Look at this alu achar. It is yummy, yummy, yummy. This is kalu dal ready to be transferred in the dish and served. Mahima is one of the birdies, really sick and maybe terminally sick. That is not a good thing. And she's trying to give the medication to the bird. Which one is the sick one? No, poor bird. So trying to give the medication? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. And his partner is over here. Here we have a family talent going on here. <laughs> while eating ice cream bar. <laughs> At least I have ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, in the kitchen there's a preparation going on for making momos. I'm gonna show you what they're making. And this is non-Bezi and this is Veggie Momo. This is especially for Joe because he is a vegetarian. Okay. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. And we saw a, a horse up, sedated upside down. Why was it? Oh, because they were doing operations. On the stomach, maybe? Or, or maybe... That was cool. Well, Joey is taking a break <laughs> from eating <laughs> and I'm going to start now. It's, the kitchen is closed after making Momo and finish eating Momo. The gift is growing and growing here. Look at this. Movie time, so it's taking Karguru too, like this. <laughs> While they are filming Darshna playing some instrument, these birds are having something. These birds, something is going on with this bird. This is Olive here. Now, it, we thought this is a male, but turned out to be female. She just laid the egg right there now leg and it looks like she still have more leg inside because she was behaving weird a couple of days ago we thought she was ill very ill but she's still having some problem laying the egg It is about three days before Christmas and people prefer to have a white snow. Seems like their wish will be fulfilled. There's a significant amount of snow today. As you can see out here, quite a bit of snow and driveway has been so old. We know mostly did and Darshan and Joe also help. Hello everyone, this is Arun Thulada, Jojo Lapa, Namaste. Welcome to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel, share, and write a comment below. Today I'm going to show you how to make a Pani Puri quickly. These days, making Pani Puri is very simple. Uh, everything is readily available, and this recipe is not my original. I got it from a YouTube. The required ingredients are a couple of boiled potato and boiled ground peas, one large size onion, cilantro, and pani puri masala. This is readily available in any Indian store. And pani puri chips. The first thing you have to do is chop this onion. all unnecessary layers and now we have got all the required ingredients and onions are chopped up cilantro is chopped up and green chili is chopped up now the next thing we have to do is put this potato and this and mix it, start smashing this. I have finished smashing this potato and uh, ch brown chickpeas. Now I'm gonna add some chaat masala and I'm gonna add some onion. Half of what I cut and throw in these green chilies, cilantro and I'm going to mix it thoroughly. The 
next step is frying this uh, pani puri chips. When, this is the fun part. Then we'll have to mix the, the pani part. And the pani part, we have a pani puri masala. All you have to do is put a few tablespoons of this pani puri masala in the water and uh, mix it. It's, it will be ready. Right now, I'm deep frying the pani puri chips. The oil is heated really well here, so you need to take it out pretty fast, otherwise it gets burned. The frying of pani puri is done. It's already popped off. And I also made the pani for the pani puri. And here's the pani, and it's very simple to make. Just read the direction in the box. It's about uh, one glass of water and one teaspoon of powder. It's time to test it. This is in the process of making gingerbread. Samsara is working very hard and cutting into the pieces, making it pieces of the brick or the panel. So what's the progress here? What is this? Uh, this is a roof? Yeah. Can you give me some napkins? Sure, please? I will. Okay. And. Uh, the structures are built here? Yeah, I'm okay. gonna do this one next. Cool. Oh, almost complete. Yeah. So how much have you done, Samsara? So what did you do, Samsara? I built gingerbread houses. Okay, how long did it take? I don't know. You don't know? So did you have fun? Yeah. Okay, explain to me what, what they are. What do you mean? Uh, the, those houses. Uh, what are those? What kind of house? Um, well, this is a square, a rectangle house, and there's two people living there, and uh -huh. there's a little spider web, and it's a little crooked, but that's okay. okay. This one is a triangle house, which is small, so it only has one person. Okay. This house is a standard house you would see. There's one person working on the roof, fixing the little... I, I would say, if it's towards Christmas, Christmas time, these could be like lights. You know, yeah. like lights you put on a tree? Mm -hmm. I guess you could say he is fixing the lights, and then that's the woman scared mm -hmm. that he will okay. fall. And then you've got this, this house, which I thought was a pretty big house, but now I'm thinking about it. Uh -huh. I think this house might be bigger. But this house, the big house, is a family of five because it's two stories and it has this room too. Okay. And then you have this house, which is really big. It's two mm -hmm. stories mm -hmm. that has one person that's living alone because all their family, all their kids moved away because they got older. Okay. And it's in the big house. And then you got the yarn, your lawn, okay. frosting with sugar lawn. Mm -hmm. That's my village. All right. Wonderful. Thank you, thank you for showing. The gingerbread house is completed. Samsara explained what it is. We also had a pani puri making session and we had a momo making sessions. And also we have some musical instrument sessions, all crazy things going on in this video. Hope you like my video. If you like my video, please do share, subscribe and write a comment below. And this is about time to end my video here. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you again in my next video. Bye-bye now.